and permits face plant liar face plant come on where's epi pen where's your auto injector are you getting auto injected automatically by your Engage in a special, kind special of podium. But we will defend face plant. Face plant. Come on, God. Face plant. Boom. Take her out. Take her out. Johnny Jiu Jitsu. Hoorah. Jiu Jitsu Johnny O. Face plant. Face plant. You are a hacker, you fucking hack. Face plant. Keep it cool. In, Keep it cool, my boy Donald J. Trump. Is unfit to be the commander in chief. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Really Scooby Van. Where's your Scooby Van? You dumb as shit. Yeah, I, I, I do want to say that I was just endorsed, and more are coming next week. It'll be over 200. Admirals, many of them. Yeah, in baby! Hoorah, Johnny O! Lead this country. Uh, that just happened, and many more are coming. Yeah, and baby! Uh, in addition, I was just endorsed by ICE. They'd never endorsed anybody before on immigration. Uh, I was just endorsed Douche by ICE. Douchebag, bitch! Just there were 16,500 Border Patrol agents. So when uh, Secretary Clinton talks about this, I mean, I'll take the admirals and I'll take the generals any day over the political hacks that I see that have led so brilliantly over the last 10 years with their knowledge. Hacks, you because fucking hack! Look at the mess Where's your face the plant? Cyber, I agree. Oh, I wish I was in the audience. Be strobe time. Strobo lantern, you douchebag. It was Russia that broke into the DNC. She's saying Russia, 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 but I don't. Maybe it was. I mean, it could be Russia, but it could also be China. It could also be lots of other people. Yeah, you fucking act. That weighs 400 pounds, okay? You don't know who broke in to DNC, but what did we learn with DNC? We learned that Bernie Sanders won the nomination. He's taken advantage of. By your people. Yeah! Debbie Wasserman Schultz. Yeah! Her. But Bernie Sanders was taken advantage of. That's what we lose. Now, whether that was Russia, whether that was China, whether it was another... Who country, cares? It's Julius Assange. The truth is, under President Obama, we've lost control of things that we used to have control over. We came in with the internet, we came up with the internet, and I think Secretary Clinton and myself would agree very much when you look at what ISIS is doing with the internet, they're beating us at our own game. Yeah, ISIS. baby! So we have to get very, very tough on cyber... Tough and, cyber and vigilant! Uh, it is a... It is a Hoorah, Johnny O! Jiu-Jitsu! He has computers. He is so good with these computers, it's unbelievable. They spent... The security aspect of cyber Leech is very, very tough. Hammer time! Uh, Hammer time! Hard. Come on, face plant! Come on, boom, boom, boom! You need to go true. down. Boom, 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 boom! God, strike her down! Do boom! Face plant. Cyber is one of them. Secretary Clinton. Oh! Well, I think there are a number of issues that uh, we should be. There is addressing. a number of issues with there. Um, I have put forward Scooby Van. Uh, it does involve going after them <laughs> online. I think we need stay to cool, my baby. Uh, with stay cool, Donald. To, Why doesn't she uh, need water tonight? She's stuffing her mouth uh, with water all the, the time. To even direct, uh, people How many drugs was she injected with? But we before this debate, how many our air druggy against ISIS uh, and eventually support our Arab druggy uh, partners to be able to actually take out ISIS uh, in Raqqa in <laughs> their claim of being yeah Islamic. right. We're making Osama bin Laden is alive and living in the Bahamas uh, and peacefully and quietly. Uh, with CIA protection at the tune of a hundred thousand dollars a month, you dumb, crooked Hillary can't even listen to you because you're a dumb oh shit, dumb as shit. I would also like to throat punch you now. A number of Along with many of my patriots. Secretary of State, including, of course, 
taking out bin Laden, and I think we need yeah, to we didn't take out shit. Uh, as well. You Make produced nothing, really. Because middle of the night. To defeat ISIS, and we've got to yeah. Do everything mm -hmm. we can to disrupt mm -hmm. their uh, propaganda mm -hmm. efforts mm -hmm. online. You're the propaganda, you dumb oh shit. Citizens who have been inspired to commit dumb as shit. Here she goes. Come on, Donald. Get her. Get her. Get her done. I'll ask this to both of you. Tell us specifically how you would prevent homegrown attacks by American citizens, Mr. Trump. Well, first, I have to say one thing very important. Secretary Clinton is talking about taking out ISIS. We will take out ISIS. Well, President Obama and Secretary Clinton created a vacuum the way they got out of Iraq. I think? Because they got out, they shouldn't have been in, Come on. but once they got in, the way they got out was a disaster. And ISIS was formed. So she talks about taking them out. She's been doing it a long time. She's been trying to take them out for a long time. She's not taking shit out. Been formed, Please. If they left some troops behind, like 10,000 or maybe something more than that, and then you wouldn't have had them. Or, as I've been saying for a long time, and I think you'll agree because I said it to you once, had we taken the oil, and we should have taken the oil, ISIS would not have formed either because the oil was their primary source. Amen. And now they have the oil all over the place, including the oil, a lot of the oil in Libya. What's the matter, Hillary? Disasters. Disaster. Well, I hope the fact checkers are turned up and turning up. Shut the your fucking pie on. hole. Donald supported the invasion of Iraq. Wrong. That is absolutely wrong. Proof wrong. 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 For the actions we took in Libya and urged that uh, Libya be taken out after. G. Gary Johnson was Aleppo. Some business with him one time. But the larger point, he says this constantly, is George W. Bush. Knocked down the trade towers. American troops would leave all seven Iraq, buildings, in case you didn't all know. Obama. Seven buildings could have with the prefix Iraq, WTC. George W. Bush is a traitor. Would have protected He's an oil man. Troops. Don't the forget that. Would not give that. Can't listen to but your fucking Lester, lies, you fucking the bimbo. You, asked, Lester, the question you, asked is, what do we you need to take a lesson States? from Monica Lewinsky. How do we you asswipe. How do we protect our people? And we I get rid of people like you and George Soros. Soros the Rothschilds. I was so proud and the of Zuckerbergs in New York, in uh, Minnesota, in New Jersey. You know, they were and George so Soros Soros the attacks uh, that occurred by Rahami and you and they brought him with your down, crooked Clinton Foundation. I can't listen to you. La 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 with your special allies. freaking podium, you posing loser. La 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 Two minutes are up. You're at the third, fourth, fifth minute. We don't want to hear your shit. You're dumb as shit. You haven't done anything for 40 effing years. See you later. Bye. See you later. Bye. See you later. Bye. Go away. Face plant time. Blah, blah, blah. The secretary said very strongly about working with we've been working with them for many years and we have the greatest mess anyone's ever seen you look at yeah the you Middle think East, it's a total mess mess your direction to look Richardson. look down bitch you look at the Middle East. you started the iran deal that's a, another beauty where you have a country that was ready to fall i mean they were doing so badly they were choking on the sanctions and now they're going to be actually What's the matter hillary major power at some point pretty soon the way it's a matter but when you look douche at video, dumb as shit asked on a major show what do you think of data? Now you have to understand I'm a business person. I did really well, but I have common sense. And I said, well, I'll tell you, I haven't given lots of thought to NATO, 
But two things. Number one, the 28 countries of NATO, many of them aren't paying their fair share. No. Nope. Number two, and that bothers me because we should be, yes, we're defending them and they should at least be paying us what they're supposed to be paying. Exactly. Treaty. Getting and ripped that, off. Because you NWO globalist NATO bullshit. Because, and I was very Luminati Benzagati. Don't forget it. Times, Luminati Benzagati. But I said they do not focus on terror. And I was very strong. And I said it numerous times. And you're right. And my buddy Donald J. I Trump. The front page of the Wall Street Journal that NATO is opening up a major terror division. And I think that's great. And I think we should get, because we pay approximately 70% of the cost of NATO. It's a lot of money to protect other people. But I'm all for NATO. But I said they have to focus on terror also. And they're going to do that. And that was... Believe me, Look I'm not at the rainbow. Food, but that was largely because on my of boy, what I was saying Donald J. Trump. Of NATO. I think we have to When's the black cloud going to hit that the thing over there? In addition to she getting automatically auto-injected as we speak? At Look at her. And we have to do it fast. When ISIS formed in this vacuum created by Barack Obama and, and Hillary Clinton. Clinton and yeah! You were the ones that took out the troops. No, yeah! They, they Ooh, here goes her eyes. Shut up. Shut up, bitch. This is something that never should have happened. It should have never happened. Now you're talking Come on, bitch. Face plan. You were Secretary of State when it was a little infant. Now it's in over 30 countries. And you're going to stop them? I don't think so. Nope. A lot of these are judgment questions. You had supported the Bigger than judgment, you asshole. What makes your I did not support the war in Iraq. That is a mainstream media lie. Put out by her because she, frankly, I think the best person in her campaign is mainstream media. My question is, since you would you like Yeah. Cooper Anderson. Randers I mean, Cooper, whatever the war, fuck your name is. Just so you put it out. The record shows I, otherwise. The record why does not show why was you, is your The record any... shows that I'm right. When I did an interview with Amen. Stern, very lightly, first time anyone's asked me that, I said, very lightly, I don't know, maybe, who knows, essentially. I then did an interview with Neil Cavuto. We talked about the economy is more important. I then spoke to Sean Hannity, which everybody refuses to call Sean Hannity. I had numerous conversations with Sean Hannity at Fox, and Sean Hannity said, and he called me the other day, and I spoke to him about it. He said, you were totally against war, because he was for the war. Why is and we, excuse me, better than and that was before the war started. Sean Hannity said very strongly to me and other people, he's willing to say it, but nobody wants to call him. I was against the war. He said, you used to have fights with me because Sean was in favor of the war. And I understand that side also, not very much because we should have never been there. But nobody called Donald Sean J. Hannity. Trump. And Look at your rainbow. In a major magazine shortly after the war started, I think in 04, but they did an article which had me totally against the war in Iraq. Face play, you douchebag. It said, you know, whether it was before or right after, Trump was definitely, because if you read this article, there's no doubt. But if somebody, and I'll ask the press, if somebody would call up Sean Hannity, this was before the war started, he and I used to have arguments about the war. I said it's a terrible and a stupid thing. It's going to destabilize the Middle East, and that's exactly what it's done. That's my, right. My yeah. reference was to what you had said in 2002, and my question was... Oorah! Tranio! Jiu-Jitsu! Mrs. Hillary Clinton. Oh, better judgment than she does. There's no question about that. No I question. Have a much better temperament than she has. You know, I have a much better. She spent. Let me tell you, she spent hundreds of millions of dollars on an advertising. You know, they get talk about Haiti, Donald. No talk about Haiti in your interview with the Haitian president. Haiti by far, is my temperament. I have a winning temperament. I know how to win. She does not have Sorry, to win. Wait. The AFL CIO the other day, behind the blue screen, I don't know who you were talking to, Secretary Clinton, but you were totally out of control. I said, there's a person with a temperament that's got a problem. Secretary Amen. Okay. Woohoo! Shut up, you dumb bibbo. You're like Bill's, one of Bill's sleazy important coos. issues that were briefly. Like cuckoo. First NATO. Cuckoo, you know, cuckoo. You know, 
as a military alliance has Dickhead. called Article 5. And basically it says Keep this, drinking, Donald. She wants the water, but she can't. And you know the only It'll make her bag blow up. Invoked after 9-11. When the 28 nations of NATO... She's a fake and a phony. They would go to fake Afghanistan and a phony. ...to fight terrorism. She's a fake and a phony. F, 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 F with the KKK bird. When I became Secretary of State, Iran was weeks away from having enough nuclear material to form a bomb. No, they weren't. They had mastered the nuclear fuel site. No, they didn't. The administration. They no, had they didn't. Facilities they had no they weapons had of mass destruction. You lying sack and of shit. Them. I voted for every sanction against Iran when I was in the Bullshit. Senate, you didn't vote for shit. Enough. So I spent a year and a half putting together You spent a year a and a half in the cuckoo bin. Russia and China to impose the toughest sanctions on Iran. And we did Bullshit. drive them to the negotiating table. And my successor, bam, John Kerry, and Bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. We're in bullshit zone. Bam, 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 bam. That's diplomacy. Woo, 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 woo. That's bullshit zone, bullshit zone, bullshit zone, bullshit zone. We're ready to attack. Attack, 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 Bullshit zone. Can't listen to that voice. She's full of shit. Like the dumbest shit she is. Dumbest shit, dumbest shit, dumbest shit, dumbest shit, dumbest shit, dumbest shit, dumbest shit. Say that ten times. Dumbest shit, dumbest shit, dumbest shit. Dumbest shit, dumbest shit, dumbest shit. Can't listen to her. The worst part of what Donald say has been about nuclear weapons. He has said repeatedly that he didn't care if other nations got nuclear weapons. Japan Dumb shit. Saudi Arabia. Blah, 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 blah. Warning, 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 warning. Dumb shit zone, dumb shit zone. We have found the enemy. The enemy is in clear sight. You know, throw punch, throw punch, throw punch. Marcella Lee, throw you know, punch, throw punch, fine, throw you know. punch. Look at her in her folks. red dress. Red, the color of Satan, the color of hell, the color of fire. Red, 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 blah, 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 blah. Can't listen to your freaking fucking voice you're the terrorist of the american people you are the terrorist 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 alert bam 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 can't listen to you bam bam red 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 alert red alert red alert red alert red alert so i just want to give a lot of things and just to respond i do with her one thing the single greatest problem the world has is nuclear armament, nuclear weapons. Not global warming like you think and your, your president thinks. Small uh, nuclear mind. Nuclear is the single greatest threat. Uh, just to go down the list, uh, we defend Japan, we defend Germany, we defend South Korea, we defend Saudi Arabia, we defend countries. They do not pay us, but they should be paying us because we are Providing tremendous service. Truth, 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 detector. Truth, 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 truth. I said that it's very possible that if they don't pay a fair share, because this isn't 40 years ago where we could do what we're doing. We can't defend Japan, a a behemoth selling us cars by the mid. We need to move on. But it's very important. All I said was they may have to defend themselves or they have to help us out. We're a country that owes $20 trillion. They have to help us out. Our, our as far as the nuclear is concerned, I agree. It is the single greatest threat that this country has. Which leads to my next question as we enter our last segment here on the still on the subject of securing America uh. on nuclear weapons. President Obama reportedly considered changing the nation's longstanding policy on first use. Do you support the current policy? Mr. Nope. Trump, you have two nope. minutes on that. Well, nope. I have to say that, nope. Uh, nope. You know, for... What Secretary Clinton was saying about nuclear with Russia. She's very cavalier in the way she talks about various countries. But Russia has been expanding. They're, they have a much newer capability than we do. We have not been uh, updating from the new standpoint. I looked the other night, I was seeing B-52s there, old enough that your, your father, your grandfather could be flying them. Uh, we are not 
we are not keeping up with other countries. I would like everybody to end it, just get rid of it. Uh, but I would certainly not do first strike. I think that once the nuclear alternative happens, it's over. At the same time, we have to be prepared. I can't take anything off the table because you look at some of these countries. You look at North Korea. Uh, we're doing nothing there. China should solve that problem for us. China should go into North Korea. China is, is totally powerful as it relates to North Korea. And by the way, another one powerful is the worst deal I think I've ever seen negotiated that you started as the Iran deal. Iran is one of their biggest trading partners. Iran has power over North Korea. And when they made that horrible deal with Iran, they should have included the fact that they do something with respect to North Korea. And they should have done something with respect to Yemen and all these other places. And when asked to Secretary Kerry, why didn't you do that? Why didn't you add other things into the deal? One of the great giveaways of all time, of all time, including $400 million in cash. Nobody's ever seen that before. No. Nope. That turned out to be wrong. It was actually $1.7 billion in cash. Obviously, Brock, insane obozo. Oh, vomit. Why didn't they make the right deal. This is one of the worst deals ever made by any country in history. The deal with Iran will lead to nuclear problems. All they have to do is sit back 10 years and they don't have to do much and they're going to end up getting nuclear. I met with Bibi Netanyahu the other day. Believe me, he is not a happy camper. That's right. Mrs. Uh, well, Secretary Clinton, you have two minutes. Mrs. Let me, Bullshit. Let me start by saying words matter. Words matter when you run for president, and they really matter when you are president. And I want to reassure our allies You're in Japan so full and, of it. and elsewhere that we have mutual defense treaties, and we will honor them. Bullshit! It is essential that You'll honor yourself be good. in Monte Carlo. And so I know that this campaign has caused some questioning and some worries on the part of Many leaders across uh, the globe. I've talked with a number of bullshit. them. Bullshit. Uh, but I want to, on behalf of myself, and I think bullshit. I'm bullshit. A majority of the bullshit American meter. people say beep, that beep, you know, beep, our word is good. Beep, beep, it's also beep, 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 that beep, beep, we beep. look at the entire bullshit global meter. situation. There's no Ooh, doubt that we have other face problems with Iran, Ooh, but where's the strobe have to light? Deal with the other problems having put that lid on their nuclear program yeah, and you, still to be you facing lost your that. lid. And you Donald never it. tells you what he would do. Would he have started a war? Would he have bombed Iran? If he's going to criticize you a deal lying that has sack been of very shit. successful in lying sack of shit to Iranian facilities that we never had. Bullshit. Before, Bullshit zone, bullshit zone. DEFCON 5, DEFCON 5. We've reached DEFCON 5. Lock it down, lock her down, lock her down, lock her down, lock her down. You intend to do nothing. Blah, 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 NWO. George Soros Soros, George Soros Soros, George Soros Soros. Blah, blah, further line my bank accounts. Liar, liar, liar. Liar, liar, liar. Pants on fire. La, 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 la. Very quickly. I will go very quickly, but I will tell you that Hillary will tell you to go to her website and read all about how to defeat ISIS, which she could have defeated. By never having it, you know, get going in the first place. Right now, it's getting tougher and tougher to defeat them because they're in more and more places, more and more states, more and more nations. Mr. Trump, and it's a big problem. And as far as Japan is concerned, I want to help all of our allies. But we are losing billions and billions of dollars. We cannot be the policemen of the world. We cannot protect countries all over the world just a, where they're not paying us what we need. We have and just a few final She doesn't questions. say that because she's got no business ability. We need heart. We need a lot of things. But you have to have some 
basic ability and sadly she doesn't have that all of the things that she's talking about could have been taken care of during the last ten years let's say while she had great power but they weren't taken care of and if she ever wins this race they won't be taken care of. Mr. Trump this year Secretary Clinton became the first woman she nominated for president by a major party earlier this she month. Laughed. She laughed. She stole it from Bernie. She's standing here uh, right now. What did you mean by that? Uh, she doesn't have the look. She doesn't have the stamina. I said she doesn't have the stamina. Stamina. I don't believe she does have the stamina. To be president of this country, you need tremendous stamina. The quote was, you I have, don't think wait, she has Wait a minute, unless you ask me a question. Did you ask me a question? You have to be able to negotiate our trade deals. You have to be able to negotiate, that's right, with Japan with Saudi Arabia. I mean, can you imagine we're defending Saudi Arabia and with all of the money they have, we're defending them and they're not paying. All you have to do is speak to them. Wait, you have so many different things you have to be able to do. And I don't believe that Hillary has the stamina. Let's let nope. her respond. Well, as soon as well, he travels to 112 well, countries and negotiates well, a peace deal, a ceasefire, yeah, let's talk about your crooked Lynn Foundation, new, uh, you dumb as shit. Around the world, or even spends 11 hours testifying in front of uh, a congressional committee. Because you're in big shit family. with your Clinton well, Crooked Foundation. Let me tell you, let me tell you. Hillary has experience, but it's bad experience. Yep. We have made so many bad deals during the last... So she's got experience that I agree. Woohoo! Hoorah, Johnny O! so in love with, where we gave them $150 billion back, whether it's the Iran deal, whether it's uh, anything you can... Name, you almost can't name a good deal. I agree. She's got experience, but it's bad experience. And this country can't afford to have another four years of that kind of... That's experience. right! Hoorah, Rod, Jenny, how did you did so? Is, you know, he, he tried to switch from, from looks to stamina. But this is a man who has called women pigs, slobs, You and are dogs. a pig, you and fucking pig. who has said pregnancy is an inconvenience to employers. Who has said, said women don't deserve equal pay unless they do as good a job as men. You don't have a rainbow. And one of the worst things he said you was bag. about a woman in a beauty contest. He loves beauty contests, supporting them and hanging around them. And he called No, like your husband. Then he called her Miss Where's Housekeeping Jennifer Flowers. Donald, she has a name. Where did you find Her it? name Where is Alicia Machado. Where did you find And it? she has become a U.S. citizen, and you can bet oh, really? she's going to vote okay. this November. Okay, good. Let Dead people. Say, Dead people. You know, Hillary is hitting me with tremendous commercials. Uh, some of it said in entertainment. Some of it said somebody who's been very vicious to me, Rosie O'Donnell. I said very tough things to her, and I think everybody would agree that she deserves it and nobody feels sorry for her. But you want to know the truth? I was going to say something extremely Please, rough to Hillary, to her family, and I said to myself, I can't do it. I just can't do it. It's inappropriate. It's not nice. But she spent hundreds of millions of dollars on negative ads on me, many of which are absolutely untrue. They're untrue and they're misrepresentations. Bitch. And I will tell you this, Lester, it's not nice and I don't I, I, I don't deserve that. But it's certainly not a nice thing that she's done. It's hundreds of millions of ads. And the only gratifying thing is I saw the polls come in today. And with all of that money, we over two hundred million dollars is spent. And I'm either winning or tied. One and I've spent practically nothing. One yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Set the outcome as the will of the voters, Secretary Clinton. Well, I support our democracy. Short and, uh, fucking sometimes shit. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. Uh, You're but losing. I, uh, certainly, uh, You're will losing support the outcome of this election. You're uh, and I know tied I'm very hard to with the undecided. It, you. I hope the people out there understand. Shit. This election's really up to you. It's not about that's us. right.
And we say no. We say no to you, douchebag. So I sure hope you will get out and vote. Vote and November 8th with your crooked, crooked elections. I want to make America great again. We are a nation that is seriously troubled. Troubled our jobs. People are doesn't even begin to country. speak the other day of the state of our country. People. And perhaps they passed the wrong button. They pressed the wrong button. Or perhaps, worse than that, it was corruption. But these people that we corruption? were going to deport from the That doesn't even scratch the surface. Citizens. What you've done, Ended you douchebag. Citizens. And it was 800, and now it turns out it might be 1,800, and they don't even know. Well, you're so look, yeah, here's the story. I want to make America great again. I'm going to be able to do it. I don't believe Hillary will. The nope. answer is if she wins, I will absolutely support her. All right. Well, that is going to do it for us. That concludes our debate for this evening. A spirited one. We covered a lot of ground. Not everything is, I suspect, What a douchebag. Uh, we'll next presidential debates are Dumb as shit. You vote for this lion sack of shit. And he didn't even unleash the, the shit that's going to be unleashed. Because Trey Gowdy and Jason Chavez is going to bury her before the next one. But my only question tonight is how in the world, with all her green screen debates and rallies where she was green screened in, how in the world did she stand on that stage? for 90 minutes without Dr. Frankenstein, and her Scooby van, her auto injector pens, and everything else. How did that happen? I really want to know. She's a big phony baloney, if you ask me. Phony baloney! Hey, phony baloney, how's this working out for you? Because Julian Assange didn't even press the reset button for your freaking that, that fucking lion ass, you dumb oh shit dumb as shit you dumb as shit lion sack a dumb as shit peace out peeps